Hey everybody, welcome back to Battle Ready Inc, the channel all about bringing you as much nerdy content as possible. Today for you, we're back in Dragon Village M, and I get this question all the time. I mean all the time. Where do I get all my eggs? All these eggs I do for all these egg hatchings every single month, how do I get just so many of them, right? Well, I'm about to tell you. As always, if you're new to the channel, please like the video and subscribe. If you like Dragon Village M, this is the channel for you. If you ever need any guides or want to see summoning videos and hatching of all my eggs every month, I do all that stuff here. I try to cover as much of this game as I possibly can. There's no one else out there doing it, so I thought I would try to help out the community as much as possible by getting the information out there to you guys. All right? So if you really want to support me, you can also check out my Patreon. If you support me there, you can get access to my Discord server as well as lots of other uh, unique things. If you are having trouble with this, then I'm hoping this video will help you because I just seem to get eggs all the time just, just playing the game. And that's the biggest thing is play the game. Do all the content. Just don't do some of it. You gotta play it all if you want to get all the all the rewards, right? All right. So if you want to just look right now, like look at all these eggs. I've just built this up in one month since my last egg hatching video, just not that long ago, and I've just got a mountain of all these different eggs, right? So how am I getting all these? I mean, that's that's why you're here, right? You want to know how I get like just look at this bushels and bushels of mysterious mysterious eggs. All right. So I'm going to try to cover as many ways as I can think up in one go. Uh, one of the ways, which is a little more in-game level, but the capsule draw, right? Oh man, those are good dragons. I wish I could get that Dark Bane. Um, but yeah, so anyways, uh, this one over here, the heroic draw, the gold. I usually have gold just coming out of my ears, right? I'll have, you know, 60, 90 million gold. I'm just like, what, what am I going to spend all this on? And I'll come in here, and I'll just start doing the 10 times draw with my gold. Uh, like I said, this is more for in-game uh, players. This one is. So uh, if you're kind of new to the game, you're still using your gold for all your dragons and, and building them up. So don't, don't spend your gold. If you have less than 20 million gold, do not come in here to try to get some eggs to try to get lucky, okay? Eggs is not how you get stronger in the game. I know, contrary to popular belief, but don't don't come in here. If you want If you want to get a bunch of summons, and you're that desperate use your diamonds and do the raid up okay don't don't come in here and spend all your gold trying to just get random eggs there's I'll give you plenty of other ways you can get eggs but for you in-game people that just have gold coming out your ears you know this is a, a great spot to spend it on uh, you get all kinds of stuff in there all right moving on from there though the events all right everyone can do this uh, it's super easy but like right now we have the dice event right and if you come in here just by participating, right? Just doing your dailies, essentially. If you do all your dailies, you'll have almost all of these except for, um, I think, the dungeon. You gotta do 10 dungeons and you get like, you have to do like three or something for the dailies. Just do a couple extra dungeons and boom, you'll get all these, these dice, right? And then you can come in here and then you can do all the spins. You see, I've done all mine for the day as well as I spent my gold and got my five bonus ones. And look at all these I'm getting as rewards, right? So. I, uh, I completed five laps around here. I got, boom, I got three of each of the, the core elements. And then I did, you know, five more after that. Then I got two more. And then just so on and so forth, right? So make sure you're doing the events that come because that's super crucial. And I mean, look, there's even mysterious eggs that you can get from this event just by landing on it. Super easy. You're going to get the dice. If you're playing the game, you're going to get some dice, okay? Make sure you come in here and spin them and don't just sit on them, okay? And let them just go away because that would really suck all right uh moving on from there a uh kind of an easy one the dragon's forest right you know you get all your normal rewards at the end you see the the unknown eggs that you get i left this one here specifically because there's a chance but every so often you can even see it right there in the back the grayed out one you can get a mysterious egg from here it, it's very rare see i didn't get it there but it does happen so just you know Make sure you're coming in here and clearing out, you know, getting all your rewards. I mean, diamonds alone is a whole, whole reason to come in here by itself, is to collect your diamonds. Um, 
but you can get mysterious eggs from here as well. All right, as well as those unknowns have a chance of making a, a three-star dragon come out of them, which is great for fodder. Okay, so your adventure mode. Make sure you're coming in here and clearing out your adventure mode. You get just for clearing this stage with one star alone, and boom, you get some mysterious eggs. That's great. The big ones, you know, if you clear out the bosses, you get the big eggs, and you clear a whole like level. And you get the nice, nice rewards for doing that. Um, so definitely put it, put in the work and clear out the story mode. I know it's, you don't get, really get a whole lot else for doing it, but at least come in here and clear out those last couple stages. All right, especially for you in-game people that have never done it just because you were kind of lazy about it. Don't just, just, just beat it so you get some free eggs. All right, all right. So the biggest, my biggest farm. All right. So this is gonna be. Uh, if you made it this far in the video, this is kind of like my big secret. I wouldn't even call it a secret, but this is where I get the vast majority of my mysterious eggs, okay? And that is farming anything. Yeah, serious. Go to any stage. You can go to level 5, uh, you know, 4, whatever. Go to the final stage. The final boss, right, has a chance to drop mysterious eggs. This is how I get so many mysterious eggs, because I'll just go and uh, and I like to go to the stage 12 of, of this one right here and come in here and hit this guy. It's a pretty easy dungeon uh, or boss fight and uh, and then just auto battling. So I'll turn on my auto pickup here, right? So boom, I've got 20 minutes of auto pickup and then I just I set my guys in the back here to one or two guys that can clear the whole stage by themselves and then I just put three people that I need to level up and I just repeat battle all right uh, end when lost that's that's kind of important because if you're losing you're not collecting anything and you're not getting anywhere so uh, this is mainly to tell me if my uh, my backup my my guys clearing the stage are actually doing their job like they're supposed to be I don't have to worry about this anymore but there for a while it was kind of sketchy so I had to turn it on um, that should not be there. Um, and then when a max level, because I don't want to be wasting time necessarily, uh, because I like to change my dragons out. And I just turn on a repeat, uh, and then just let it go. And then so once my dragon hits, you know, max level, I go in there and I uh, go to prepare for battle, change him out, put in like another three star or a four star or a five star that I'm trying to level up, whatever, a six star, and just keep repeating the battle. Uh, if I'm going to bed for the night, what I like to do is put in some higher level guys, so or higher star levels, right? So a five or sixes. I mean, because they'll farm all night long, and literally my runes in my inventory will fill up before they ever hit max level. Before I ever run out of energy. Yeah, don't even look at that disgusting amount of energy. Uh, <laughs> I get more energy than I can even auto battling for 24/7. I can spend. It's it's nuts. So that's how I get the lesser eggs. Now, how do I get the big eggs, right? Uh, you know, the the big five-star guaranteed eggs, that sort of thing. Well, like I said, the dice event, you know, making sure you're completing it, coming in here, doing it every day. If you're doing it every day and you're getting your max, you, you don't even have to be at end game. As long as you're just doing the content like it says to do, then, then you'll get, you know, the big stuff, no problem. I mean, I've got six days left and I'm already halfway there and it, and it's been what three days since this event started so it's pretty easy to get there if long as you just are playing the game all right um, but the bigger ones so come to the shop this is what I uh, this is kind of my big sellers for the month is uh, is coming here and grabbing these guys mileage mileage is the first big one I get um, I always go for the legendary egg I mean the guaranteed five star is way beyond anything else here uh, yeah these are a lot cheaper but the Pretty much the fact is you'll never hardly get a five star out of these maybe one in every 10 or so you'll get one and if you mathematically add that up that's you know the chances of getting it out of here is you know 7,000 mileage you got to spend or this right here is 2,600 for the chance of getting one five star you know it's it's like a one in ten chance and then but this guy's guaranteed I could literally get twice as many of the ancient eggs basically five stars than I could out of that and I mean sure you get some four stars but I mean what four stars do you need compared to five stars five stars is how you get your mastery fodder all that stuff 
you need four stars, just go do the right up. As long as you're doing the ten summons, you're guaranteed to get one four star every set of ten. So make sure you're always doing a set of ten. Do not do individuals unless you're doing just a single one for the daily. All right. So this is where I get a lot of my legendary eggs uh, coming in here after I'm doing the raid up. So, uh, and in case you're curious what I mean, the summonings here, doing the, the raid up right here, or even the van advanced summon, every time you do these, you get mileage, right? And then you can come in here and spend your mileage that you got to get these guys. All right, moving on from there. Uh, one day, one day I'll be able to get out of here, but uh, it's not this day. Um, don't get this. If you if you get to the, all the way up here, get the selection ticket. You get to pick what you want. There are great options to pick. Okay, way better than a random shot at, at a uh, absolute. I can get an absolute almost every single month. I've been playing this game for what two years now, two three years, something like that, and I haven't even gotten uh, up there yet. Okay, so if you're gonna spend years farming. And you're going to save it, go for the selection ticket. Okay, I'm just saying, get the selection ticket. Uh, but Clan Coin, this is how I get my absolutes. Now, the better option is getting the enhancements. The enhancements, these guys are so much harder to get uh, for your uh, five star dragons. This is what I spend the vast majority on. However, even then, I'm still going over every month. And uh, I mean, this is the fourth. I've already bought both for the month. And I've still got the rest of the month to save up. So I'll definitely be, by the end of the month, have more than enough to uh, buy one of these absolutes and come in here and get an, uh, in uh, November and get my enhancements for November as well. Um, the other stuff, if you need the four star, get the four star as well. Um, the skill ups are a little less so. I mean, they're not terribly expensive. I mean, they're only 100. Um, but I think there's just kind of other ways you can get these guys. It's a little bit easier. But by all means, do what you want. Uh, all these are great, great options. Um, the enhancements is the best one, but this is the best way to get absolute legend or lap. Yeah, absolute legendary eggs is out of the clan coin shop. All right, uh, moving on from there, uh, the event tab. Uh, just make sure you know you're checking on here, especially if there's a red exclamation point. Make sure you check, uh, click that. Um, mainly just for the uh, the check-in. Uh, there is a check-in event right now, which is cool for the, the falls. Um, but scroll down. The check-in. Uh, make sure you're coming in here every month, getting all your, your eggs from there. These are the ones I wait for. Once I get my day 28, then I do my, my summoning video. So that's the guaranteed. I'll have at least two of these legendary eggs for my videos. Sometimes I have more. Sometimes uh, well, I'll always have two. Unless I accidentally click on one. I haven't done that yet. Knock on wood. But I'm always stressed that I'm going to accidentally hatch one of these guys and, and throw off my whole whole thing. Um, and then playtime. Just come in here, you know, collect all your, your free stuff. Ancient Tower. Make sure you're doing your Ancient Tower. Make sure you're doing your Ancient Tower. Uh, the rewards you get from this are, are crazy. You get uh, mysterious eggs, diamonds. I mean, you get all kinds of stuff. Uh, skill ups, legendary skill ups. Make sure you're doing your tower test. You get some eggs from here as well. Uh, it's not very much, but it is something. Uh, tower of test as well. I've started a new series where I'm going through, and uh, every fifth floor, in, I'm doing, uh, I'm clearing them all out and recording it. But uh, you get great rewards: two thousand diamonds there, some enhancements. I mean, this is just the the end stuff. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, that'd be nice to get right there. That bad boy. The mythical egg would be super cool, you know. As well as there's, you know, higher you go, the more and more eggs you're gonna find. And the very last one I want to come over is the witch's cauldron. All right, there's gonna be always eggs in here. Uh, you know, you'll get a couple a day, right? Um, as well as you know, there's other good things in here. I usually always buy these guys here. Um, this is mainly what you're gonna spend your uh, your ancient wings on. Uh, is coming in here into this shop. Some people like to save them for these guys up here. My thing is. I'll always have diamonds usually, or at least most of the time, I'll always have, you know, at least 10,000 diamonds. And uh, so I can spend on these guys if I need to, if it's something I really, really need. Or what I like to do is I spend my ancient wings on these guys all the time. If there's any eggs in here ever, I come in and get these uh, right here with uh, the ancient wings. And you get these from uh, doing the towers, like I was talking about. Make sure you're doing your ancient tower. It is super crucial. Do your ancient tower. The rewards are just outstanding. Probably the best rewards in the game that you can get regularly 
and for a pretty decent amount of them, okay? Um, but that's really going to conclude it there, and doing all those methods, you know, combining them all together. One individual method, sure, might not be too crazy, but literally just doing your dailies, playing every aspect of the game is going to just net you so many more eggs uh, in this game. Uh, just mountains and mountains of eggs, okay? Literally bushels and bushels of baskets of eggs. So make sure you just do everything, and you'll you'll come out looking like this all the time, all right? Uh, I hope this video is informative. Uh, if you did find it informative, please like it. If you're not already, please subscribe to the channel. We're getting closer to that 1,000 mark, which will be super awesome. I can't wait, but I need people like you to help me get there, okay? So greatly appreciate any, any kind of support you guys can give. Um, but yeah, that's going to do it. So as always, I'll see you next time.